What did it mean to your program to get into the NCAA tournament and now you're heading into the, the fourth year of the program? Yeah, if, you know, it'll uh, mean a lot if we use it right and I use it as a springboard. Obviously the guys who, that played uh, have never been there before, any of our student athletes, so they'll have a real good appreciation now of not only what it takes to get there, but also what we've got to do to learn from that experience and, and, and not play the occasion and just and use it to, to enjoy the experience, but also use it to fuel our fire that you know, with the disappointments at the end of the day, we felt we probably had a couple more wins left in us. So uh, use the experience, but move it using false. It's, it's not a one-off, it just becomes a regular part of our season that you know, we play deep into November, December in the NCAA tournament. I think our message will be is to, to start this year how we finished last year and to show that, and to, to build some momentum. You know, the, the team showed that they can endure because it was a tough start. Some things went against us that were out of our control. Um, but we had a tough start and we came together as a group. I think it talks a lot about the character that we've got in the, the programme. Coaches, staff, but more so the student athletes uh, that they showed that they can endure and push forward. So we'll use that experience knowing that when we did get it clicking and we had everyone fit, that down the stretch we were pretty good. You know, we were pretty good. We were multifaceted. We'd, we'd, uh, we, we had different guys scoring. We scored a variety of goals. Knowing that we've got to clean it up at the back it's still a little bit because you know, we went out of the game, uh, finished our season when we scored three goals. That shouldn't happen. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a good, again, a springboard for establishing who we are as a programme, uh, uh, you know, some of our core values in, in what we do and how we do it and, and move it forward. So, like I say, it's just that becomes a regular part of the season that you're playing deep into November. Goals again, hopefully. You know, like I say, it's, um, you need to score goals if you're going to win games, and, and we've certainly got. A lot of threats going forward, different threats, uh, guys who can play underneath and get on the ball and, and keep it flowing, the stretchy guys who can run in behind with some pace and power and then we've obviously got an aerial threat with some of the bigger lads we've got up front so you know, how you score is up to you, you know, ultimately you've got to score and you've got to get the ball there and how you get there I see varies on a multitude of things but we kind of hit on a bit of a formula halfway through the year that allows us to get in the areas that cause other teams problems so we'll continue to build on that, evolve it, develop it while still trying to find other ways to be creative and, and, and you know mix up what we can do, whilst also not the aim of the game is, is to win. I say how we how we do it is up for discussion, but as long as we do win, that's the main the main aim. Yeah, you know it's it's not just the guys at the back; it's as a group. So obviously we're still going to try and play in the areas that hurt the opposition more than they do ours, and, and try and lock games in there, those areas. That would be a big key. How we can stay in the front half for a little bit longer. And then when we've not got the ball, just our togetherness as a group to, to get together, be compact, be balanced, um, you know, nullify any threats that we see against coming against us, um, and just play the game as a team on both sides of the ball and see where it takes us. Yeah, it, it, it is tough, it's real tough, but I, I'll, that's a good thing, and I think that is one of the factors that has allowed us to come so far in a short space of time. There's no easy games. You know, you look at the year before, Davenport had won a national title, won our league, deservedly a very good side, and then this year they finished where they finished. Still a good side, it's just on any given day, it's a team that turns up, you know, and they'll be a real threat again this year. You look at us, I think, the way we started, the way people thought we were going to finish, and then we just got it going midway through the year, and like I say, we, we were probably the form team at the end of the year. So I think our one our one loss in the second half of the season came away at Saginaw in extra time, so it's, and they ultimately won the regular season. So it's a good conference, you get challenged every game, Learning, hopefully. I think one of our uh, one of the few negatives from last year was the way we did start the season, and it wasn't down to one thing. It was a you know it was a multitude of things, but certainly I think our fitness levels coming into it, and we never had the lineup that we thought we would have, really, until that last week in September, going into the first week of October, due to mainly fatigue injuries. So I think the guys have learned from that, knowing that now they know what it takes and what it feels like when they when they do put it all in. Uh, so. I think they'll come back ready, ready to compete, ready to get back to that level. The nice thing was our spring season. You know, it showed that the, the last seven or eight weeks of the fall weren't a fluke. We had a very good spring, played against some established programs. Not only Division Two programs, but teams that have won national championships at Division One, and, and we got a result in every game we played. So I think that that confidence and belief is, is something that you can't coach and you can't teach. But they've got that. So if they take that away, learn from what we start, what we did this, what they did in the summer, what we did last year. I know they're going to come back fighting fit, hungry, ready to go and, and get back to, to where we finished.